Welcome to the Morning Update. I'm Erin Roan. Aussie swimmer Emma McKeon has become the most successful Commonwealth Games athlete of all time, taking an 11th gold. She snabbed a win in the 50 metre freestyle. Fellow Aussies Meg Harris and Shana Jack taking silver and bronze. It's still Emma McKeon in front. Can she get there? Does she hold on? She's got her 11th. The Queen of the Commonwealth out on her own. That call thanks to seven there. Australia sitting on top of the medal table with 20 gold, 13 silver and 17 bronze. The PM is sure to have a bounce in his step today. The latest news poll shows Anthony Albanese has recorded the highest satisfaction rating for an incoming PM ever at 61%. Labor is ahead two-party preferred, 56-44, up almost 4% since the election. It comes as the PM pushes for a referendum on a First Nations voice in Parliament telling CNN it's a priority for his government. Our priority this term is the recognition of First Nations people in our constitution. Our history didn't begin in 1788. We're being warned more gas shortages are on the way. The ACCC's latest report warns of a shortfall of up to 10% across the East Coast next year. The watchdog calling for Canberra to step in to renegotiate agreements to ensure we have enough domestic supply. Hundreds of Qantas passengers were stranded on runways across the country yesterday after an IT glitch delayed up to a dozen flights. The nationwide computer problem was uncovered at around 4.30 yesterday afternoon and impacted 12 domestic flights with some being delayed for an hour and a half. And bad news for beer drinkers with the biggest tax increase in three decades on the cards. It means we could soon be forking out $15 for a pint. To Sport Now and it's brought to you by Ladbrokes Mates Mode, the better way to chat, share and bed together. T's and C's apply and remember, gamble responsibly. Call 1800 858 858. Australia remains at the top of the medals table at the Birmingham Commonwealth Games. We've got 20 gold, 13 silver and 17 bronze. While in the NRL, the Dragons have been thrashed by the Cowboys 34 to 8, while the Bulldogs were too good for the Knights, taking that one 24 to 10. And in the AFL, Richmond has kept its finals hopes alive with a come from behind win over Brisbane at the MCG. And for even more sports news, make sure you check out the sports update. You'll find it wherever you're listening to this show. In entertainment news, an Amber Heard has sold her home in Southern California for just over a million dollars. She snapped it up in 2019 for just over 570 grand. And JLo has headlined a UNICEF concert in Italy to help with the Ukrainian relief effort. A stack of other celebs were in attendance as well, including Leonardo DiCaprio, Naomi Campbell and Jamie Foxx. And that's the latest from the Nova podcasts team we'll see you later on for another episode of the update